Liz Cambage set a WNBA record with 53 points the other day against the New York Liberty. She can score in a variety of ways, in the post, with a face-up jumper, on pick and rolls, and she even has added a three-point shot to her arsenal. So let's break down how Liz Cambage set a WNBA record with 53 points. On this attempt, we see Cambage get switched on multiple times by different defenders, finally gets a mismatch in the post with Kia Stokes and gets in for the easy layup. On this attempt, Alicia Gray gets in an easy entry pass because Amanda Zowie B tries to deny the pass. And then afterwards, we see some spice from Cambage. On this attempt, we see Skylar Diggins start to initiate the pick and roll. You see Cambage set the screen. Skylar Diggins drives to the paint. The defense collapse. And Cambage has a wide open lane. Easy layup. Now that the defense knows that she can both post and dive, it's time to step out and take a shot. We see here pop out catch and shoot. In a more recent development of her game, we've seen Cambage even step out and attempt at least one three every single game this year. Here we see her right here, gets the shot, takes it. No one's gonna front her or even close out on that shot because they don't respect it yet, but soon they will. This is how she scored her 53rd point of the game. Now it's time to face up. As soon as somebody's gonna close out on a shot, she sees it, takes the defense, takes one dribble, up and in. Her balance is so good on shots like that. And here we see it again, but from either farther out. We see Skylar Diggins initiate the offense, get it to Cambage, a smaller defender switches onto her, and she just takes her all the way into the paint, spins, and gets the layup. Free throws were obviously huge for Cambage, who was 15 of 16 from the line in this game. But this was very important as we see the defense get caught all watching the ball and Cambage is wide open in the paint for a touch. And she gets fouled by at least two defenders. Check out how she scored the rest of the points on Mavs Moneyball and we'll be back with more WNBA Wings coverage.